Yamaha XV700 and today I'm going to show you uh, how to install so-called the final fix for the uh, Virago's famously known starter issue and what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to install the uh, voltage stabilizer and what it does is actually it uh, gives or provides uh, enough electricity for the electrical unit that uh, creates this power. And if you ask me why do you need additional power, and that's because whenever you are starting the engine, the engine, uh, the starter draws a lot of uh, electricity and the uh, spark plug uh, unit does not uh, have enough electricity. So that's why we need it additional stabilizer to provide that uh, shortage of voltage but before that let's hear how it starts before uh, the unit is installed and uh, the bike now is cold and <laughs> cold and dark and yeah and I haven't uh, driven it since I don't know two weeks I guess so let's hear how it starts without the additional unit installed to this uh, spot and we need to take this cable out because uh, sorry connector we need to take this connector out because there is the unit that is uh, providing the electricity for the for the next unit I guess that is short of uh, voltage and uh, this is the unit that we will be installing and I got it off of the uh, AliExpress and yeah, it has uh, four wires, two blacks, uh, that's for uh, ground or minus, and uh, two other ones. So the red one, there is also a red one that is plus for the input side, from, and it takes in the eight, from 8 to 40 volts, and uh, then another one, yellow one, uh, that is the 40 output plus, and it gives uh, direct or uh, stabilized 12 volts also plus so we will I guess uh, stick it probably somewhere here or uh, I believe here and uh, connect the wires to get access to this unit I have to uh, uh, I had to unscrew this one I don't know how your looks uh, this is the voltage regulator rectifier but I uh, this is the aftermarket one so you probably you have something uh, else and we have to squeeze this, uh, squeeze this uh, connector and pull it out. Okay, this is the plug, and uh, I unwrapped this, uh, I guess, uh, tape piece that somebody else left. And we have to locate the wire with uh, the red one with the white stripe. At least that's what uh, the original source says. Okay, we have it right here and I'm gonna cut it I'm gonna cut it just uh, right here to give you give here some uh, room probably in the middle where yeah somewhere here like uh, five centimeters from the connector okay so I fitted everything together just to test how ev everything works no welding no <laughs> soldering no nothing just a quick uh, crocodile uh, crocodiles to see how it uh, if it starts and whether it starts better so let's see how it starts with this really bad battery also okay three two one Whoa. what an improvement what an improvement 
man, did you hear? I just barely touched the button and it just like uh, fly straight away. <laughs> Let's see for another one. Yeah. but it starts right straight up. I'm amazed. Come on! What an improvement! Uh, the first one was... Uh, you heard it. It was like... Uh, I just touched the button and it started right straight away. So yeah, it's definitely worth the money. What an improvement. Okay, so to wrap this thing up, uh, the final setup is like this. I have installed this uh, voltage stabilizer. Uh, I have grounded these two black wires to the frame and it goes uh, straight into there. There's also some other uh, ne ne negative ends um, connected. And then I have uh, soldered the output wire, the yellow one. I don't know how your looks like, but mine is yellow. The output positive wire to the uh, connector. To the connector and the other the input uh, uh, positive wire to the uh, to the other end of the wire it goes uh, straight somewhere here inside yeah and that's it and uh, I will uh, stick it I guess somewhere here because of there is a uh, wind and it will cool down the frame of this uh, unit Okay, so everything is set up and uh, for the last time, for one more time, let's hear how it starts up. Three, two, one. Man, that's perfect. That is perfect. I'm so happy with the result. Okay guys, thank you for watching and I hope you had some uh, fun and you do the same. For your Virago. Let's uh, let's meet somewhere on the road. Bye.